the general term of the series is k times n choose k divided by n choose k minus 1. This can be written as k times n factorial upon k factorial times n minus k factorial multiplied by k minus 1 factorial times n minus k plus 1 factorial divided by n factorial. n factorial cancels across the numerator and the denominator. Some of the other terms simplify and we are left with k times n minus k plus 1 upon k which is equal to n minus k plus 1. Now putting k is equal to 1, the first term of the series, c1 upon c0 is equal to n. Put k is equal to 2, the second term of the series, 2 times c2 upon c1 is equal to n minus 1. k is equal to 3 implies that the third term of the series is equal to n minus 2. And so on, so forth. The last term of the series is equal to 1. Adding all of the above results, on the left hand side, we have the given series c1 upon c0 plus 2 times c2 upon c1 plus and so on. The last term being n times n choose n upon n choose n minus 1. And on the right hand side, we have n plus n minus 1 plus n minus 2 plus and so on plus 1. The right hand side is the sum of the first n natural numbers which is equal to n times n plus 1 upon 2 which is the required answer.